All right, friends, I got a bit of an assortment today to open up. Uh, if you didn't know, currently GameStop is doing its $5 buy a bag, fill it up with collectibles, and get 20% off sale, and that includes all the cards. So I'm gonna just go right into some of the first things that I picked up. I've never gotten the, the Pokeball tins before, so I got the regular one, I got the Premier Ball, and I also got the Dusk Ball. Um, and these have three packs each in them, so I will, um, I think I'm gonna open up all three of those. I got some regular assorted packs or not assorted, they're all Cosmic Eclipse um, and, and blisters, single blisters. Definitely gonna open up some of those. I got the Score Bunny Galar collection with the Zamazenta V Jumbo promo and the Score Bunny pin. I also picked up one of each of these League Battle decks. One comes with the Charizard tag teams, and then the other one has the uh, Pikachu and Raichu tag teams. So those are not to open, that's to keep sealed for sure. And finally, I got the, I got more of these Burning Shadows mini albums with the, with the pack in it. I got one for every pack art. And I might, I might save a couple of these, but I'm definitely going to open this one. And if there's nothing out of there, then may, maybe I'll keep opening them. I'll see. First, I'm going to open up the Score Bunny uh, pin box. This has uh, two Cosmic Eclipse, one on Broken Bonds, and one Evolutions. I'm gonna open those up, and then it comes with the Jumbo Zamazenta V promo. I think that this one is the, it's one of the last ones that they did the bigger version of the Jumbo card, so that might not fit in the new Sword and Shield um, Jumbo card binder thing. And since the code card was already showing. Here you go. And then we got the Score Bunny promo, the Sobble promo, and the Grookey promo. And I believe that these same promos come in other various promo boxes that you can get. So let's see. First, I'm gonna open up these Cosmic Eclipse packs. I think I might keep that evolution sealed for now because I really don't need anything from that, so I think this be like a treat for later. Alright, so the green code. Whoa. Upside down and backwards reverse rare. So let me just go into this the normal way. Pip up, Ralts, Kyogre non-hollow, Chaotic Swell. Interesting. The next pack. Another green code. Erica, Vibrava, Great Catcher, Deerling, Dupider, Golet, Apom, Onyx, a Reverse Eevee, and then an NK. So a couple of non hollow legendaries. And then Unbroken Bonds. I have not been able to open a lot of this lately, so there we go with the green code. So nothing great out of this box, really. A great pack selection, totally, but not really pulling anything here. Reverse Ryolu, and then a Lolan Doug Trio. So next I'm gonna start um, opening these, these Pokeball tins. Uh, will I need scissors to open this is the question. Nope. I can just rip it right off. So 
So that was a lot more difficult to unwrap than I thought it was going to be. Um, yeah, this is the first time I've ever gotten one of these. I know that it comes with three kind of older packs, nothing that's standard legal, and then they gotta get squished. So we got Ancient Origins, Lost Thunder, and Burning Shadows. That is not too bad. I'm gonna set those aside, and then we got a Rowlet coin. I don't really need that. Alright, so I got that open. I got it unwrapped. Burning Shadows, Sun and Moon Base, and Evolutions. I think that these were out at different points, so that's why they have slightly different packs. There's a Zero Aura coin. Very nice. Okay, so here's the Dusk Ball. I'm having trouble with this. We've got another Zero Aura coin. And again, we've got Sun and Moon. I mean, yeah, Burning Shadows, Sun and Moon Base, and Evolution. So, what to do with these? First, I'm gonna open the Ancient Origins and the Lost Thunder and see what kind of fun stuff comes out of that. The code colors do not matter because this is an older set. I think it's three to the front. Porygon 2, Sligu. Tyranitar, Spirit Link, Relic Cant, Meowth, Eevee, Porygon, Ball Toy, a Reverse Ball Toy, and then a Vest Queen Non Hollow Rare. And then next, let's just open this Lost Thunder. Well, there's a code card. Hit on top, Fava, Electabuzz, Cyndaquil, Pineco, Combi, Litleo, Cutie Fly, a Reverse Hoppip, and then a Beauty Fly, also non hollow. Um, let's open up these. Sudden Moon Base? Why not? Green Code, yay. Let's open this up normal. Trumbeak, Hypno, Alima, Eevee, Psyduck, Spiro, Tatini, Cutie Fly, Reverse Grubbin, and then a Hollow Dragonite. Let's go ahead and keep the evolution sealed for now, and then I'm actually going to open up these Burning Shadows. Green code. Reverse Pikachu, and then a Weavile. Another green code. I've seen people have a lot of luck with these uh, Pokeball tins, but I'm not seeing Oh, there's a Reverse Charmander. That's pretty good. And then the last Burning Shadows pack. Another green code. So that just means I have to crack into the other Burning Shadows pack. So we've got a Reverse Super Scoop Up and a Crab Abominable. Now I'm going to open up these Burning Shadows packs. I'm just gonna toss the little notebook for now, or the little binder thing. I'll probably be giving those little things out, the little binders to when, you know, when League starts up again, I'll just give them to like new players, little kids, stuff like that. Reverse Mudbray and Alolan Ninetales. There's the other one.
Ooh, this feels... I know it's just the glue or whatever, but that feels feels really weird. What am I getting this out of again? Yeah, this isn't... This isn't looking too good. Pikachu, Noibat, and then I think it's another Alolan Raticate. And this is the last burning shadow that I'm going to open. Thank God a white code. Porygon 2, Weakness Policy, Simi Sage, NK, Duskull, Tynamo, Cutie Fly, Riolu, Reverse Sock, and a Marshadow GX. Alright, hashtag Homes for Hollows. So that's actually the first hit out of the whole night. Now, I think um, I'm going to keep this sealed for now, just for now, and then I'm going to open up these Cosmic Eclipse packs. Just going to rip them all at once. I'm sure I'm gonna look back on this in the future and oh my god look at that three of the baby trio packs in the future I'm gonna look at that and be like why am I you know ripping up these packs so nonchalant when I could be saving the wrappers and someday they're gonna be vintage or whatever Tangela, Eevee, Duskull, Timple, Flabebe, Reverse Tropius, Ursaring and then some other stuff Oh yeah, it doesn't matter if there's a green code because in this set you still might hit the supposed secret rare that takes up the reverse spot. And one that has a lot of value actually is the Red's Pikachu, which I have yet to get in my collection. Wubat, Ducklet, Helioptile, Cosmog, Slugma, and this is exactly what I'm talking about. Um, this is the Exadrill. Put that aside, and the rare is a Weavile. So sometimes it looks like you're not gonna get a hit, but you'll get those kind of, sort of common secret rares that are just called secret rares, but yeah, we have Brava, Probopass, Igglybuff, Pikachu, Teddy Ursa, Nosepass, Litleo, Bebe, Reverse Cosmolim, and then Ursa Ring. Getting lots of doubles. Everything. A white code. Beleba. Beleba and Bryson Man. I believe that this is, is banned currently in the card game. Type Null, Heracross, Golet, Dupider, Apom, Onyx, Tepig, Reverse Coughing, and a Gold Tag Call. Excellent. I've actually pulled this from a single pack before. So that is going into the trade binder. So pretty much these were the only hits to really speak of. Marshadow GX, Tag Call, and Exit Drill Trainer Art. Thank you guys for watching. You should see some more content soon, so consider liking the video and subscribing to the channel. You'll see me soon.